It is a great satisfaction to greet you again. I hope you and your pet are well. Today we will talk about the following. How to recognize and treat a seizure in your dog. As an owner, it's worrying to see your pet having a seizure, but any signs you notice can help your vet decide on future treatment. Of course, it's critical to recognize what constitutes a seizure, as opposed to fainting or a collapse episode. 1. Understand the phases of a seizure. Before a seizure, abnormal electrical activity is generated in the brain, and after the seizure occurs, it takes time for brain activity to normalize again. The length of each phase varies depending on the severity of the seizure episode. Here are the three stages of a seizure. Aura. This is a period of time before the seizure when the animal shows a behavioral change. Seizure. The neurological episode. Postictal. Recovery from the seizure during which the neurocircuitry is trying to normalize. He may be confused, bump into things, and appear blind. 2. Recognize the signs. Many animals that have seizures show subtle signs in the time leading up to the seizure. You can learn to recognize the signs to better prepare for an impending seizure. Pre-seizure signs include restlessness, pacing, and an inability to calm down. It's as if your dog knows something is wrong, but doesn't know what to do or how to make himself comfortable. Some dogs become excessively vocal, whining, barking, or crying for no apparent reason. 3. Pay attention to aura signs to ensure your dog's safety. If you recognize the signs, now is the time to give your dog preventative medications, such as rectal diazepam. This helps cancel out erratic brain activity and can reduce the likelihood of a seizure occurring. It also gives you time to put your pet in a safe environment where he can't hurt himself during the seizure. 4. Know when the seizure is happening. During a seizure, your dog will collapse and lie on its side, with all four legs extended, in a rigid posture. The head will arch back and the eyes will roll in their sockets. After a few seconds, the legs will begin to splash or make swimming movements in the air. A seizure may contain some or all of the following symptoms. Mouth chewing movements. The dog loses conscious control and random electrical activity in the brain stimulates the chewing muscles. Tongue protrudes from the mouth. Drooling and profuse salivation. Climbing, paddling, and swimming movements performed with stiff legs. Loss of bladder and bowel control. Generalized tremors and jerking. Muscle contractions are caused by erratic neurological impulses from the brain. 5. Keep in mind that your dog will be very confused during the seizure. He is not aware of what is happening around him. Your dog's higher consciousness centers are overwhelmed during the seizure and his brain is flooded with random electrical stimulation, which drowns out the conscious centers. He probably won't respond to his name or anything around him. Your dog can't see or hear because his hearing and sight centers in the brain are flooded with random electrical messages. 6. Recognize if the seizure lasts longer than 20 minutes. If your dog has a seizure that lasts longer than 20 minutes, take him to a vet immediately to prevent permanent brain damage. This is known as status epilepticus and requires urgent veterinary care to reduce the risk of long-term brain damage. Keep in mind that the average duration of a seizure is between 2 and 3 minutes. Seizures usually don't take long to go away, although they may seem much longer when they happen to your pet. Less frequently, seizures can be longer, around 5 to 10 minutes. 7. Be aware that your dog has entered the post-seizure phase. After a while, your dog will come out of the seizure and enter the post-seizure phase. Typically, your pet will appear confused, disoriented, and staggering on its legs. It may wander aimlessly and even run into walls as if it were blind. This phase can be brief, lasting about 5 minutes or so, while for some it lasts for hours. A normal seizure usually does not cause permanent damage, and the disorientation and blindness are temporary. A slightly odd symptom of this is that some dogs appear to be very hungry and actively seek out food. Make a note of your dog's seizures when they occur so you are better prepared for the next time. Remember to time when it starts and ends. This is helpful information for your vet. It is a pleasure to inform you and help you, if you have not subscribed to the channel you should do it now, take care of yourself and your furry friend, a hug and until the next video.